the album and I wouldn't be surprised that people wouldn't know this album and by the title of the review we are going to be reviewing a classic 1989 album Autopsy Severed Survival Now, Autopsy is a band that was formed by Chris Reiford, which he played on the legendary first wave death metal album, Death Scream Bloody Gore. And after after uh, after the Scream Bloody Gore album, he uh, he didn't want to do work in like he didn't want to be in death anymore after like him going back and forth forward from Florida to San Francisco so after that he um, he wanted to form autopsy and they released a demo back in 1987 which is um, the autopsy 1987 demo this is original pressing from 87 with the cassette and the t uh, tracks on here that were um, there's only two tracks that are on the f first album which is Embalmed Stillborn. There's only two tracks that are not on the Severed Survival album, uh, Human Genocide and uh, Mutilate Death, To Death, my bad. And then they released a demo after this in 88 called Criminally Insane, then after that they got signed to Peaceville and they recorded this album in Star... Star Starstown Studio uh, in around early 89 and then it got released probably around the middle of 89 um, this was produced actually funny fact by Kirk Hammett's guitar tech from Metallica um, he, uh, he, he produced the tracks and engineered it I believe and technically the bass player that was on this album is Steve DiGiorgio that uh, that was in Sadis and you know him for a ton of other bands like Death and um, and Testament and whatnot we all know what Steve DiGiorgio does now um, but this version of Severed Survival which the original version of Severed Survival is this because they had one other artwork that was kind of a uh, tribute to Hellraiser or kind of like that but this is technically the original pressing of it uh, this came out in 89 um, and I think the I like the I like both the original artworks the one with the um, the one that looks like the um, Hellraiser one and then this one uh, this was released off Peaceville and all like this is a classic death metal album this pretty much inspired a lot of bands such like Incantation, Immolation, Cannibal Corpse, Entombed 
a lot of class a lot of death metal bands were inspired off this one you know among others but this was one of the most heaviest death metal albums of its time along with Ultras of Madness, Soul Your Rod, Consuming Impulse uh, and shoot I even throw Beneath the Remains in there too even though at more is more on the thrashy side of things but I would still consider it um, this is different from a lot of the records at the time because a lot of records at the time that was produced back in 89 that were death metal records were produced at the legendary Scott Burns more sound Florida this is nothing close to that the production on this is very bassy and if like it's it sounds disgusting it just like it reminds me of a mixture of Hellhammer and like like some other stuff that I would consider this would be like um, but Severed Survival is great beginning to end um, my favorite tracks are um, Chartered Remains Stillborn Embalm Critical Madness um, the lyrics on this are just disgusting and vile it, it gives it gives like this is the death metal album that describes like in my opinion it's like when you want to put like the most horrific music that describes something very well this is it this is like this is the album because this is the one band that can't make that can make the most disgusting lyrics in my opinion and come off really really fucking good music but yeah autopsy severed survival and highly recommended album I'm Rock and Roll Snaggletooth and I'm signing off.